Hello, and today I'm going to show you how to share your Outlook calendar both through Outlook 2013 and Office 365. Sharing your calendar is a very useful feature in both personal and workplace scenarios as it allows your acquaintances and coworkers to view your schedule and plan around it. Let's get started by first looking at Outlook through the browser. Go to office.com and sign into your account. Once you're signed in, simply hit calendar. And then on the left, you should see all of your calendars. Select the one you want to share and right click. Hit share calendar. And type the contact you'd wish to share to. And hit send. Now I'm going to show you how to do it in Outlook 2013. Open the program, and in the bottom left, you should see Calendar. Click on that, and then in the toolbar, you should see the Share section. Now I'm going to go through what each of these options do. Email Calendar sends your calendar to any email address. But note, it will be static and not updated over time when you make changes to your calendar. Share Calendar will send an Exchange Calendar to any other Exchange email and it will update to any changes you make. Publish Online will, by default, publish your calendar on Microsoft servers. You will be given a link to send out to anyone you wish to see your calendar. You can set the calendar as public or restricted to certain people. Calendar permissions, as the name implies, allows you to set individual users' permissions for accessing your calendar, such as being able to add or delete events on your calendar. Let's go through Share Calendar. You simply click the button and then type in the name of the contact you wish to send it to or email address and hit Send. The process is almost identical for email calendar. Simply open it, select what you'd like to show, and then uh, type in the email address once again, and hit set. With Publish Online, you simply hit the button, and then hit Publish This Calendar, sign in online, choose your options, how long you want to show, whether it's public or restricted, hit start publishing and you will get a link to show the calendar. The calendar permissions option, you can add people from your contacts and then select their permissions such as being able to create new items or delete items.